much for coming to our headquarters opening for our great mayor, Mayor Tony Harp. Woo! I'd like to have Reverend Cousins come and bless the food and bless the office. Put some good spirits in us. <laughs> Amen. Let us pray. Gracious Tony God, we thank you for today. We thank you for the rain this morning. And we thank you for the sunshine this afternoon. Amen. We know that even through the storms and through the clouds, you will always be with us. And you are faithful. God, we ask right now that as we do the work, building up your kingdom in this great city of New Haven, that you continue to bless our leader of this city. Continue to cover our mayor, Tony Hart, as she does the work of all the residents that live and reside in this community. We ask right now that you bless this headquarters. Let it be a place of peace and prosperity. And bless the food. And bless the hands that prepared it for the nourishment of our bodies. These are all the blessings and the praises we sing in your son Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. So everyone, uh, we have a special announcement. Uh, one of uh, long-term Harp supporter. Uh, I call him the man that makes the, the mayor smile. <laughs> is uh, a newlywed. Where's the wife? Can we have a hand? Je Devin Boyle. Devin, we got married on Saturday. Uh, hey. Without further ado, Alex is going to introduce the mayor. Thank you so much, Jason. Let's hear it for the mayor. Oh, first, let's hear it for the Reverend. Yeah. Reverend. And for everybody who came out here today on this beautiful day, you couldn't have picked a better or more auspicious day for the start of a great campaign. Let's hear it for that. Yeah. And we should hear it for our mayor, okay? Yeah. Things are moving here in New Haven. We're doing things in New Haven. We're building things in New Haven. Let's hear it for that. You know, over the last five years, we've had five balanced budgets. We've had more jobs and less unemployment. We've seen cranes go up and we've seen poverty go down yes. because we've had a mayor who's been working for all of us yes. in this city. So let's hear it for that too. Yes. New Haven is one of the oldest cities in the United States. It was founded in the 1600s. How many of those years have we had a mayor who works for all of the people of New Haven? Not many, am I right? But as long as Mayor Harp is working for us, we know somebody is out there who's working for all of us. That's what we knew when... Oh, boy. This way? Don't move. I'm a bit of a pacer. Got a little bit of nervous energy in me here. Never really, you know, never really does something this important, so bear with me. But I just want to say one more quick thing because we got to get to our mayor. When she was working for us up in Hartford, she worked for us for many, many years, yeah. and she looked after the kids in particular, yeah. the future. And that's what she thinks about when she goes to City Hall every day. Now, when I first worked for her, I worked for her on her first campaign. I was, I was on the coach of the debate team. I came to be the de debate coach. That's yeah. why I was, she was smiling, because all I do is make jokes. That's the key to debate. Because <laughs> most of these debaters that she's up against are kind of a joke. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so, so what I found out was Mayor Harp is not about the flash. She's not about the politics. She's about the kids and making sure that they have a strong future. So she needs other people to look out for her politics, getting out there on those doors, right. making all of those phone calls, because throughout all of this, she's going to stay focused on what matters. So let's stay focused on our mayor. Let's go out there and work for her, yes. and let's make this another great campaign. <laughs> Thank you so much, Alex. Uh, that's why I learned to debate. Let's give a round of applause for Alex. Thank you so, so much. First of all, I just want to thank all of you for coming out tonight. Uh, you know,
know, one of the things that I know for sure, there is no me as mayor without all of you. There is no me without all of you. So I just want to thank all of you for what it is that you do on behalf of our city, for your community activism, and for your belief that New Haven can be a place like no other. You know, when I was a little girl, I was one of the little girls, like so many of you, who believed that America could be a place that would be a place for everyone to be somebody. That everybody in America could make a life that is meaningful for them. I believe that. That's what I grew up believing. On, and man. I saw as I go. grew older that it was harder and harder to do. But what I know for sure is that in New Haven, if it can be done anywhere, it can be done here. And frankly, we have evidence of that. When I first ran for mayor, we had an unemployment rate of 10.7. Now it's down to less than 4%.
in our lives. And so those are the things that we're doing, but we're not going to stop there. Before I leave, in the next term, I want to make sure that we build the Dixwell Q House. And there are so many other things that we need to do together as a community. And you know, honestly, there are some people who say, I, 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 I can do this for you, I can do that for you. Well, I say we right. can do this right. together. Yeah. We can build the kind of community that works for all of us. Yeah. And so I want you to join my campaign. Yes. Because yes. my campaign is your campaign. It's the campaign for this city that will show every other city in Connecticut that it can be done, that we can all work together, that we're all valued. So I'm going to need you on the phones, I'm going to need you on the doors, and I'm going to need you walking with me Woo! and holding that vision that we can do this together and we can become greater than we have ever been. Right. Thank you so much. I need Woo! you. We will be say why you harp New Haven. I harp New Haven because whatever the answer is, that's why I harp New Haven. Okay? We're going to give those back to you. Put them up on social media. Hashtag I harp New Haven. All right, folks. Thank you. So the headquarters will be open every day, starting at 10 o'clock, if you want to come and volunteer. Oh, the rest of my uh, okay. Just so you know, it'll be open every day at 10 o'clock. We're looking for folks to sign up and volunteer.